Hello, my sweet mysterious pixie here. Oh, and there's Petunia. She's always got to be so nosy and see what Mama has. She knows it's crafting time. So I went to Michael's and I picked up this cute little, it's called a bungalow, but it's a little like uh, four piece section to a dollhouse. And there's like all these little sections that you can create each room, uh, I guess, completely different. So I picked out the bungalow one because I'm going to do a gothy witch kitchen. So let's stay tuned for that. We're going to do it. I want to show you how I create this cute little kitchen. But first, let me show you the things that I bought because right now all this stuff was 70% off. All their dollhouse stuff. So I picked up this little table that was super cute. These lights. And what else did I get? Oh, let me get this cute little lamp. I know it doesn't go with the kitchen decor, but I had to have it. It was only like a doll or something. So pick that up. And look at it. I found a little stove. Look, it's so cute. And it came with that little cast iron pot. And it was only $5. So score. Oh, gotta have some wine. Mm -hmm. Look at this little bottle. So cute. So all this stuff was 70% off. So I grabbed some wine bottles to add just for cute little decor. This cute little mirror. Probably gonna add something to it to make it more a little more creepier. And look at these little books. They were super cute. I'm sad to say I didn't use it. I didn't put them in the project. I put something else instead and I'll show you in a minute. But look, I found this cute little um, kettle and it comes with four little coffee cups. Super cute, so that's going in the kitchen. Look at how tiny they are. They look so tiny. Got this cute little bench because eventually I'm probably going to add on. I'm probably going to do like a living room and just keep going on. Just keep it all creepy cute and goth style. So pick that up since it was 70% off. But I didn't use it. Um, this cute little bistro set. Didn't use it. I ended up using just the white table that I showed you before. But I know it's, all these things are going to sell out. So I just had to get it now. I'm gonna save it for later. And of course, last but not least, this cute little fridge. And it's metal. This thing is super heavy. Super cute. And the door's open. Super cute. So that's everything that I picked up for this project. And plus I picked, oh, let me get my finger all the way. Plus I picked up, I took all my little scrapbook stuff that I used to like scrapbook in the past. Oh, and there's Petunia. And I just grabbed a whole bunch of things because I'm not sure what I'm going to use. I'm just going to wing it. And let's see what I create for you guys. Okay, so let's get started. I'm going to play some background music and kind of speed this up. And just, just kind of watch me um, start putting stuff together and decorate. So I will probably see you at the end of the video when we do the little tour. So enjoy the music, guys.
guys, so this is the final result. I'm going to give you a little tour of my witch's kitchen dollhouse. So there's the little the Ouija board that I made. So I downloaded that image from Google and then printed it on some of the um, semi-gloss photo paper, which I got at the dollar store. And then those creations are from my resin molds. I thought they're so cute. Got my bats and then the little twisted sister twins. Got this chandelier at Michael's a few years back. Here's that mirror. And I decided to just glue one of my resin bats that I made. And here's a lamp. I thought that was so cute, those little wine bottles that I found also at Michael's. Because right now all their dollar their own um, doll house stuff is 70% off or well, at least over here where I live in California so I took advantage of their other special that was going on and decided to just have fun and create my own little gothic witch kitchen so now I just need to get a little witch in here <laughs> but look at this little stove super cute came with a little cast iron pot this little teapot Ooh, this little teapot I bought separately came with four little mugs which I have the two back there which they were tipped over already and then the other two at the table look at this sticker per fits perfectly on this little table that I also got at Michael's oh the little top of the I guess over there okay but yeah look at this sticker it's perfectly and it goes with the theme super cute got that on Shein I got like a whole pack of stickers for like under five bucks it came with like I think like 48 of those decal stickers so I thought that fit perfectly on there then I made those um, jars well I didn't make the jar I made I poured resin in them and I'll probably put a little clip in because I was gonna do a video but it was just super short so I just went ahead and insert a clip here so you can see how I made those so basically I just bought those little jars at the dollar store they come in like various sizes and I just want to see if I can pour resin in them and see what would happen but super cute look how it came out put some pearls in there and some glitter and resin dye and let it set overnight I thought they were cute that would go perfect with this little kitchen and I just love how the floor came out with the stamps. That little refrigerator is cute. It's heavy too. It's all metal. Super cute. I don't think I have anything on top. No. I should have put a skull in there. <laughs> oh, I just knocked over the wine bottle. But, oh, in the top. I didn't like how it came out, so I ended up covering up with stickers. So, that's what I did. Oh, and there's the train. But these are some of the other stickers I got from Shein. This was in that bundle. Sorry about the train, guys. <laughs> okay, well, this was my little crafty video that I wanted to go ahead and show you guys and share with you guys. Hope you like. And, oh, I forgot that. Some more bats. There we go. And then there's the little images that I stamped and I showed you and embossed them. And then here's the other one. So I need to add a little curtain, add the tool material. Oh my God, this train, really? Well, I'm gonna go ahead and go. So thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment. You know, I love you guys and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys, thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.